Interesting. Okie doke. That didn't take long. Got the village buttoned up tighter than a skin flint's coin purse. So, where do we start? Could listen in on the soldiers. Could try and count their weapons and provisions. That tent in the back is worth a look, too. Don't be spotted. Not a nerve the League's got stirring up trouble like this. What happened to their promises of friendship from that co-expedition? From what I hear, they want the rune barrows we found for themselves. That's why they're relocating everybody who lives in the area. Bunch of grubby bastards. I just hope they turn over those crooks from the watch so we can all go home. Killed? Please don't. Who goes there? Let us change our plans and fall back! Hey! You're not- Let us change our- Good.
Stop! Right there! We've been spotted! do we have here? Yeah, they're preparing to attack, and they ain't pissing around either. Provisions and weapons? Enough for a whole legion. They are serious. <sighs> so there is gonna be a war? Not if Lady Perio can help it, I imagine. But whatever happens, we follow orders. War with the Empire. Worry later. You want to try that big tent next? Are the preparations complete? Nearly, sir. We'll break this insignificant country and serve it to the dukes on a platter. My cap needs a finer feather after all. That's gotta be the commander here. Though it sounds like he reports up to somebody else. Security looks tight. Best stay clear. Okay, so I guess we hit the tent in the back and then we're done? Really? The guard just left his post? I know, right? Sloppy. He's gonna catch it when he gets back. Come on, don't stop there! It appears that we won't be getting back that way. Pretty lady, you gonna make some noise for me? That's a good girl. Yes, you are, Sylvie. That Byrunic lens reactor of yours is ready to pump out 500 poles of pressure. A heart that big deserves to be loved back. But first, we need to get you all gussied up. Oh, I love you, Sylvie. You're my special lady. What the heck? Ah! Who, who are you? You didn't, um, I don't know, hear any of that? Hear any of what? 
I was just giving my lady... I mean, I was talking to the... Well, not like conversing, but verbally running checks on this inanimate thing. Uh, great, I guess. Do I know you? You're not with the army. <sighs> Good thing, too. They'd never let me live this down. I take it you're not a soldier. Nuh-uh. I'm more of an engineer. See? Duke's Aldrich wants to improve on her rune lenses work. They're too fickle and magical, and they're also tied to specific wielders with unpredictable potency. He's looking to develop technology that lets everyone wield them equally. Who's there? You! Wait, Hildy? Sound the alarm. Yes, Mom! Well, crap. Don't let the intruders escape. Oh, come on, really? Let's go, Noah, now! But... Right. Um... Who was that, Mom? <sighs> the enemy. Why did Hildy do that? I, I thought we were buds! Shut your mouth and move already. There they are! Heads up, guys! Big mistake. Staying are welcome. Are you the intruders? Well, so much for stealth. A fight it is. Let's get it done! Got you now! What? Uh, uh, come on! Uh, so... Uh, is it? Uh, no. We're done here! That's what you get! Nice. I can feel the improvement. Gotta say, this could really be going a lot better. Unless we bust through. We've got you now, League scum. Time to swat some flies. Leon's gonna teach you a lesson! Let's get it done! Okie doke! <laughs> 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 you 
Lisa! Yoma! So... Is it... What? What? So... This... Is it... So... This... Is it... Die! Right up. Training is the friend that never betrays you. Monsters. You're the ones ravaging our villages. No, we... Sorry, brother. Nothing we say is gonna make this right for either of us. Let's move. Right. Stop them! Come on! Amir's waiting for our report. War... I can't believe it. Well-timed, oh great captain. I was just about to report to her ladyship. You can accompany me. Sure. All right. So, they have enough weaponry to arm a legion, as well as several months of provisions. Hard to imagine this chapel fellow in command needs that many men just to take some so-called raiders into custody. We've received information that Dukes Aldrich and his army are en route to Norsferia to requisition the Empire's newly annexed territory. As for the reinforcements we requested, opinions in Eucharist are divided. The Chamber of Lords in particular is reticent to be dragged into what they view as a problem between Eltisvice and the Empire. It doesn't help that a tidy sum is riding on the Norsfarian purchase, and the Lords are fearful the deal will fall through. King Yuma Shireth, for his part, is amenable to providing troops, but the Lords have spooked him into inaction for now. That sounds like Yuma. Blast it. I should have foreseen the money issue. If that was part of the Duke's hand, he's even craftier than I thought. Well, I didn't expect help to come right away, so at least there's a sliver of hope. Mm. Sounds like we'll be hunkering down here for a few months until Eucharis comes around. Won't be easy. I did as her ladyship asked, and augmented Eltis Vice's food stores. We have enough for a year. Thankfully, time is on our side. The longer the war, the harder it will be for those noble dolts to feign blindness to the enemy's ambitions. So there it is. We fend off the Empire's first attack, then weather the long siege. I'm counting on you all. We won't let you down. Hmm. Noah, was it? Emir, give him command of a unit. What? 
My lady, just because Gar trusted the boy with temporary captainship of a very small company is no... He's clearly eager for more, and I'm sure Gar and the others will mentor him. Isn't that right? I've always been good at showing folks the ropes. Good. Because wars are shaped by the right narrative. So the story goes something like this, perhaps. Though the boy's home was raised by the cowardly empire, he found the courage to take up arms in the face of despair. That'll work. Make sure it's the talk of every tavern and hall by the end of the week. Oh, I suppose raised is an exaggeration. An embellishment. Milady. If I may. Yes, Janequis? What is it? You look haggard. Yes, well, fighting for your life will do that to a woman. I was just about to come find you. They're holding a war council. It's happening! So this is it, huh? It's been a long two weeks. This'll be your first big battle, right? Come on, let's go see what Gar and the others are up to. <laughs> Some stress relief, perhaps. Do come again. There's Noah. Our scouts report the Imperial Army is on the march. I need all troops in defensive positions. You are ready, I presume? Yep. Good to go. We'll win today. No matter what. Heck yeah! I like the confidence, but keep your heads out of the clouds. We're looking at a long battle here. <sighs> Those imps don't stand a chance! Come on. Defend your positions at all costs and step lively. Though we face just the one legion, sloppiness will still get you killed. We gotta stop those damn imps here and now. Don't let them set one foot inside the walls. Got it. There it is. The tiny nation that dared bear its fangs at the Empire. But even the runt of the litter must be brought to heel. Galdeans! Advance! Fight bravely. All of you. In the name of her ladyship!
On your guards, all of you. You shall not pass. Yeah, what he said. They seem to be retreating. Is anybody hurt? Apologies, we were delayed. Sorry, she was... I mean, the rune tank was having a bad morning. About time the Kessling boy arrived. Though the Duke's favours him, he will stay out of my way if he holds even a lick of sense in his head. One of your pathetic lies. Attack! So he is here. Legion destroy. Praise is in order. They're inside the walls. Don't give up. Keep fighting. It's too late. Forgive us, your ladyship. Let's do this.
Defend your positions at all costs. We gotta stop those. not for everyone attack you chose to harbor the Lieutenant, are you...? I'm fine. A healing life to ease all wounds! You should retreat! Tell the others!
Isn't that... Noah. So he is here. For the glory of the Empire! Don't let your guard down! <laughs> Why do these insects simply refuse to be squashed? Too bad for you! We're the most stubborn pack of fighters you'll ever face! We just need to hold out a little longer. I am Noah! Uh, sure. You tell him. Of all the fool... General Chapel, sir. We, uh... I know, damn you! Fine. We'll regroup and crush them later. Maybe in another lifetime. We did it! The enemy is retreating! Well, now. I'd say we've all earned a spot of rest. And with that, the trap is sprung. What? No, it can't be! Impossible. War isn't about soldiers scrabbling at each other trying to draw blood. War is breaking your enemy's spirit. Watching their eyes widen like frightened hares before a wolf. Bringing the meek to bay. He marched his entire army from Norsfaria? But none of our intelligence gave the slightest indication of... And an enemy's heart is never more vulnerable than in the moment they believe victory is at hand. That is when you reveal your greatest weapons. Overwhelming numbers and fear. Go forth, Galdeans! March as if none stand in your way! Become fear itself! This can't be happening! Damn it! Ah, we're doomed! Run for your lives! We need to get to safety! Pagar! Warriors don't die like dogs! They pick themselves up off the ground and they damn well survive! Uh, you're right. Noah! Gar! Leon! You all right? Oh, sure. Peachy. Now, come on. Emir and the other soldiers are regrouping at her ladyship's manor. Take control of the town, and do try not to embarrass me in front of the dukes. Yes, sir. Quickly! You all made it. Where's Emir? Inside. How's it looking out there? They're closing at speed. Whatever we're doing, we better do it fast. Milady, we must get you out of here. Do something! 
protect her! I agree. There's no time to lose. We'll gather the remaining soldiers. And then take everyone and escape through the East Gate. What are you saying? You're coming with us, milady. Aren't you? No, I'm not. However, the distraction you create is going to help me escape. There's a secret passage by the manor that leads to safety. One of House Groom's little insurance policies. I'll use that while you make for the exit. But we should decide where we'll regroup, because I haven't even begun to fight. A secret passage, is it? Well, how about that? Oh, oh, I know. We should meet at that ruined castle we found. That's perfect. There's no way the imps will be able to squeeze all their men through that mine. Good. Then it's decided. Hmm. Very good. Then we'll meet you there once we make our escape. Your ladyship, you take Jane Quiss and... Uh, let's see. If you need a bodyguard, I am... Nope. This job's mine. I'm a strict follower of the mercenary creed, which is to stick with the person least likely to get murdered. You're not gonna make me break my creed, are ya? Wow, that's convenient. <sighs> Just take care of her. If that's settled, it's time to go. Good luck, my lady. Travel safe. You too, Emir. Uh, Noah, might we speak privately for a moment? Wait, me? I know time is short, but I would beg a boon of you. Uh, that's like a favor, right? In the offhand chance. No, in the one in a thousand chance I don't make it out of here alive, I want you to raise an army in my place. You want me to lead the resistance? No, because in 999 possible futures, I'm doing that. I'm only asking you to cover the one slim possibility that remains. Will you do it? Okay, but why me? I had the privilege of observing many people as I grew up. And what I came to learn is that most people in this world cannot be trusted. However, there are exceptions. Not many, and they are difficult to find, but there are trustworthy people out there all the same. I'm asking because I think you're one of them. Uh. Also, you remind me just a bit of someone I once loved. Uh-huh. Now, be gone with you. You're supposed to be my distraction, so get out there and start distracting. Yeah, mule! Whoosh. Okay, okay, I'm going. And I promise I won't let you down. Good luck, Noah. The Chatterbox returns! So, how was your talk? Where to begin? He can tell us later. Noah, I want your team to take the vanguard, break through, and open the East Gate. I'll follow once I've assembled the troops. Understood. Hands. 
I'll show you what a magical girl can do! All right, let's move! Where are you going? I see him. They're here already. Any last words? Ah. Yes. Wait, what? Lens. Wait, wait. Uh, so. Yes. Is it? Wait, 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 yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, Not a hair out of place. This magical girl just powered up! Move! Move faster! The town is nearly in our grasp. General! The enemy stragglers are making a break for the East Gate! Hmm. That's where the Kessling boy is posted, isn't it? Yes, sir. And Lieutenant Kessling has asked us to send more troops. Nonsense. He can make do without. Begging your pardon, General. But his unit is just a few soldiers and the rune tank. From what I hear, the Dukes view same Kessling as a singular talent. So what, pray tell, does the Wonderkind have to fear from a few League stragglers? Have faith in the lad. <laughs> How do we get through? The hard way. Hey! You're with the watch! Hmm. Interesting. Keep it moving, people! to the East Gate. Yeah, but look. I see. So no reinforcements will be coming. We're all alone? Well, that's fantastic. The thing is, sir, General Chapel, he... You don't have to explain that man to me. Paul, get the rune tank running. We'll use it as a barricade. Right! Lieutenant.
Zane? Is that you? Noah. <sighs> You've seen what I've seen. You know this war is unjust. I do. However, my place is in the Imperial Army, and my house's responsibilities now fall to me. Look, you've got ambitions. I understand that. But my situation's changed, and I have to leave through that gate. Noah! Lieutenant! Stand down. Please. I cannot! You need only lay down your weapon. No. I made a promise. And I cannot convince you to walk away. Not a chance. Cannot convince you to walk away. Not a chance. So be it. Then my duty as an Imperial soldier is clear. Get ready, Noah. I am ready. Is he holding back? I'm not letting you stop us. Surrender, Noah. This war is already over. Like hell it is. If you continue to resist, I will have to hurt you. That doesn't change a thing. Surrender! I swear on my house's honor that you and your friends will be spared. It's not happening, Sane. And if you're gonna be stubborn about it, of us will bend, then we will fight till the lesser man breaks. My turn! Try me! I'm sorry, Sane, but you're not getting in my way! In the name of House Kessling, I will bring you in line! Come, Noah! Do your worst! My turn! Try me! Here I come, Noah! Do your worst! My turn! Try me! Yet it 
What about your friends up there? Damn it, Sane! I made a promise. Still meddling, I see. You will not leave this city! Fight harder, Noah! Hold back! Noah! Back off! Surrender and you will be treated fairly. House Kessling would never... Cousin! Hurt you, Annie. It seems our time is up. Noah, are you all right? You made it. One hundred brave souls. I'll keep Why didn't you flee with the others? I have a nasty habit of investigating my employers, and I'm pretty damn sure House Groom doesn't have a secret passage. You're the distraction. You did it to save everyone else. Then I ask again, why are you here? You could have treated us like pawns, but you never did. That kind of loyalty deserves to be paid in equal coin. Besides, you look like a lady with one last trick up her sleeve. Milady? Is he here already? Oh, heavens, but I applaud his efficiency. We meet again, Miss Groom. I don't recall seeing you on my calendar, Your Grace. <laughs> Ever proud, aren't we? I thought we might take this moment to discuss our future relationship. Are you about to propose, you cad? <laughs> Sadly, I am already married. However, if you are willing to reassess our other relationship, I will permit you to keep your status, your wealth, and this manner. A generous proposal, don't you think? You want me to join the Empire? To join you? What happens to the other League states? Their age has concluded. What concern is it of yours? I see you for the brilliant mind you are. Swear fealty to me, and the entire League will be yours. Oh, now we're talking. My offer pleases you. Oh, it's very bold. And... It makes my skin crawl. A life of luxury beneath your heel? I'd sooner get down in the mud with the other soldiers and fight you to my dying breath. How dare you speak to his grace that way? Enough, Chapel. You impugn my honor, young lady. A fine jest to speak of honor. The Emperor of Galdia still draws breath, yet you carry yourself as if what's his is yours. <laughs> that is one opinion. Now, if you'll excuse me, I believe we're done here. You cheeky. <laughs> oh, but you are a fiery young woman. To choose sleeping in some barracks instead of the Empire's finest silks. Show Miss Periel to the gates, and if any man lays a hand on her, I'll have his head parted from his shoulders. I can see myself out. Oh, uh, milady. Your grace, how can you... It's just a woman and an old man. They pose no threat. Mark me well, dukes. The day will come when this woman erases the triumph from your face. That 
is a promise. Until then, I bid you farewell. We guided the surviving soldiers back from the mines. There were a few stragglers lost in the tunnels, but I don't think we missed anyone. Good work. But where is her ladyship? You don't gotta worry about a tough piece of leather like her. Besides, Sabine's there to keep her safe. do now what about you Noah you gonna head back to your village those imperial scumbags drove us out of our home like common bandits which we are <laughs> wait really nah it's a load of crap but all they needed was a pretext and they got one her ladyship's suspicions were sadly accurate. We need no further confirmation of Duke Aldrich's territorial designs than the army he commands. Okay, but the other nations of the League are gonna help us, right? Right? It is pretty to think so. But the Dukes is a crafty man, and he may attempt to frame the war as a limited dispute between the Empire and Groom. If he is successful, our allies may hesitate. <laughs> Agreed. They ain't gonna stand up to Galdea until the fires of war are burning on their doorstep. They'll pretend not to hear, while the Empire sharpens its knives and prepares to take another slice of the continent. <sighs> All right, so what do we do? I mean, we clearly can't go back to Altusweiss. And I loved it there so much. <laughs> I know, dear. Listen up, everyone. There's something I need to tell you. Her ladyship bade you raise a resistance army? Yeah, cousin, let's do it. We can't let those imp vermin march around our home like they own the place. So there's a chance we can get it back. <sighs> what do you want to do, kid? Sure, the lady asked it of you, but that don't mean you're obligated. Uh... I already promised her. You sure about this? Yes. Well, if that is her ladyship's wish, I won't object. Let's go raise an army. Yes! Now we're talking! So, this means Noah is in charge, right? I mean, at least for now. Uh, w wait, me? Why? Cause you're the one she asked, dummy! Oh, cousin. This is such a special moment. Let us be clear. Noah is in command on a provisional basis only until her ladyship returns.
Yes, yes, very good. Still, these ruins will require serious work if we're going to station an army here. How'd you sleep? Cause I feel like I got hit by a wagon. Amir's been working us like dogs all week, and these scrawny arms are really not made for heavy lifting. He said it's to make sure everything is ready for Lady Periel. Guess it's his way of worrying. Anywho, everybody's gathered in the Great Hall. Wanna go see what all the fuss is about? <laughs> 